Welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Primal Ops. And today, there was, well, there has been an update a while ago, but today we're playing it. And yes, we're still in the new setup, but this time we have, I think, better audio quality. I'm hoping. I do have a fan now blowing on me, so it's nice and cool. And we also have the besties over there. Um telling you to subscribe if you haven't <laughs> so you're gonna notice as like videos go on we get slightly more competent dear um so we have the this new thing that's come in um of course microtransactions that's not really what i'm here for um so yeah this game is updated i can't exactly remember what it updated but you do have a couple of new things the way that i think we've already shown that missions have changed so i think they may have changed again actually so you do get tarandon at the end and i think that was the difference like there was three for all of them except ch chapter nine but nine i think you're guaranteed to unlock all of these dinosaurs the, the further you go which is pretty cool unlock them in order you can't just like do chapter one normal then chapter one hard then chapter one elite you have to unfortunately kind of go around dear um but we do have so many so many other stuff to show you like um stegosaur is so close and the like the ui has just become so nice like this game is updated so well i really like it <laughs> so now at the bottom you've got like it tells you it's tail whip damage it's traits so if you click down here 50% bonus damage to gunner enemies that's if you get it to rank two and 50% damage bonus to grenadier uh, and then if you get to rank 4, 75% chance to slow and rank 6. For every 1% stamina missing, gain 1% increased damage. So, I think that is basically the lower its health goes, because uh, that's what they call stamina, the lower its health goes, the more damage it does. So, so if it's at 99% stamina loss, so it's on 1% health, it has basically double damage. So that's pretty cool. And it hangs around a lot, especially at rank six. It's going to hang around for ages. Um, so we've almost got Homalocephaly to rank four. <laughs> but look at this. We've got all of this. So pushes back enemy on contact. Does 100% increased stamina against Kozlov. And 50% damage bonus to gunner enemies. This game's just like, I love it. I really do like this game. There's so much in it. Uh, we are able to rank up uh, Antarctica Pelta. So we may as well. So we're going to rank up all our dinosaurs first. Then we're going to open up loads of crates and stuff. You know, just do the wonderful things. We've also got uh, Carnotaur. Taurus. Oh, there you go. Rank nine. Still don't really know what this does. You get upgraded. Oh, we got a one extra battery. That's generous of him. <laughs> so the interesting thing with leveling up, it makes no sense. So if I show you here, we go to level up Carnotaurus, right? So we get plus eight for its power, plus three for energy, and plus one for damage. Okay. I mean, fairly random numbers, but uh, we'll just say that makes sense. We level up once. Then all of a sudden, the next uh level... We don't level up its damage. We level up its energy, however. And we also level up its power. But six and three, do it again. Uh, four and two, seven, three, and then a bit more damage. <laughs> it makes no sense as to why. I'll, I'll get it to level like 20. But like sometimes I, I, I don't get it. Like eight, then six, then five. And maybe 10? I have no idea. No idea what these arbitrary uh, levels are, but it, it is interesting. So, oh, look at that. Immune to poison. Well, that's good. It applies poison on hit for three seconds. At rank two, we have 50% damage bonus to hunter enemies. So we're getting it to rank two. Now, I think it's really only uh, gold dinosaurs that you see the benefit after rank three. There's like nothing extra for anything else. Which I guess makes sense, but at the same time, it would be nice to have at least common dinosaurs have some sort of bonus for, you know, making them as good as they are. Uh, so we are, like, leveling up loads here as well. Um, I'm hoping we do eventually see um, some celebrity dinosaurs come into the game, a bit like we have seen with, um, oh, what is it? Uh, Jurassic World Alive, because you have Rexy in that as well now. Uh, Trodon, we can rank up, oh god, to rank 5. Um, it's still, yeah, Velociraptor family dinosaur upgrade. No idea what that does. It just gives us lots of stuff, which I'm all here for. That's what I'm all about. So we'll do Kendrasaur to rank 4 as well. Again, just some extra keys to open up some chests. One extra battery, which is great. That's something that is ne they've never done in these games, uh, especially with Jurassic World Alive. You know, you used to have batteries, and I guess you still do, but they used to be more of a, a, a thing in game that would really make a difference. 
Um, oh, wow, you have loads of stuff. Applies pushback on hit and applies stun on hit. Oh, my God, you're actually really good. Why haven't I leveled you up before? <laughs> we'll do you. We'll rank you up again to level four. But in this game, they... Because, I mean, in Dress World Alive, you've got batteries and you'd have to, like... You could buy batteries as well. Um, oh, my God, my coin is dropping as well. I didn't even notice that. Um, but here, you actually increase your limit. You don't do that in Dress World Alive. It's like once you run out of batteries, you have to spin the supply drop to get it. Um, which I guess makes more sense in this one because the higher up rank or level you go, the more uh, time it takes in order to... Or more, like, energy it costs to do a battle. Um, so that's quite nice. We've got events here. So you've got this one, which is, um, you basically just get a load of coin. But if you die, that's your lot. So I will give this a shot because I think last time I did it, I died. <laughs> so that bodes well. Uh, we'll put Carnotaurus in here because we got him to level 20. It does tell you if it's, it, right, you're strong. Okay, so we should be able to do this pretty easy. I mean, it's enemy power level is 1,300, and we've got a team that is crazy strong. So, heck yeah, let's go. I want to get my Stegosaur to rank 2. I just, like, a level 20 Stegosaur. Oh, it would be so freaking good. I'm so happy I've got this working as well. Ooh. Also, I'll show you a boss battle I had yesterday, um, which was really interesting, because every level now has a boss fight. Um, and it was, a, like, sometimes they call out, and they... They um, get back up. But this was one I hadn't seen before, which was quite interesting. Uh, that vehicle up ahead looks like it would lead a convoy. Would it really? <laughs> it really doesn't. <laughs> Make sure no one sees you place the tracker device on it. That does what do you mean? I've got placed the tracker bug on the vehicle. Right, there's literally no way of me actually getting over there without. So I'm just going to kill them all. So, ha ha! Wave one incoming! Rubbish! So, Stegosaur is boss. We, we just kind of hang around. We do have a Carnotaurus. And Carnotaurus now is really good for splitting up enemy. Split up enemy. Very good. There we go. Carnotaurus. Off you go. Yeah, look at it go. It looks so good. Da! So, eventually, we will get back to a green screen. It will happen. But at the moment... <laughs> oh! See that? <laughs> like a boss. That was amazing. <gasps> Hide behind the tree. I mean, the, the truck. I mean, the leading convoy vehicle. Sweet, we're doing good. Oh, 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 okay. Ooh. Okay, he's, he's taking... Oh, no, oh, no, not the baton man. Leave me alone. I think I'm rank 50-odd or something. Oh, I only take one damage. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> no, no, go on then. What are you going to do? <laughs> Just some running at you with an automatic rifle. <laughs> yeah, nothing you can do. Nothing you can do, son. Right, this guy's apparently absolutely terrified. Uh, I'll save that health in case I need it. It'd be interesting if you shot the health that explode. Oh, what's that guy doing? <laughs> just ran into the Stegosaur like, no! Oh god, oh god, that's a lot of grenadiers. Yeah, see, what's great about Carnotaurus is stops the, like, the enemies coming towards you. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh god, um, probably should have saved for the Stegosaur there, but it's okay. It's okay. Yep, there we go. Just shoot him in the back, even though I'm not aiming for him. <laughs> oh, what a twirl! Ooh, what a twist! Okay. Oh, 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 oh. That's a lot of fire. He's blew something up there. Look at the stegosaur. I might as well just run through it. It only does one damage. Yeah, and I'm going to need coin, actually, after realizing how much uh, everything is cost to upgrade. So we've got two ranks left. There's apparently one more dude, which I have no idea. Oh, there he is. Yes! Ho, oh, oh, ho, obliterated! <laughs> Oh, uh, you're petrified, aren't you, dear? Yes. The cartoon is just chomping on it. <laughs> right, where's everyone else, huh? Where you at? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's also got an automatic rifle. Mm -hmm. Although he's not really firing it. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> oh, there it is. Finally, a bit late. Okay, here we go. Oh. Six damage. How dare you hit me? Ease peace. Ease peace. In fact, I, I do loads of damage if I just run up and smack them, apparently. Right, there's one dude left. Aha, there he is. He's like, oh, there's a few of them. I'm absolutely ter petrified. I'm terrified. They're ter terrified. I got your hand on. Oh, oh, is it? Oh, there's quite a few now. It's okay. I got this. I got this, man. I'm a pro. Season professional league. Yeah, me. You are. Yeah, Stegosaur's got this. In the bag. Oh, 
Oh, it's so good. I don't know if I'm getting much coin from this, though, if I'm honest. It's like 10 per. Go on, then, last dude. Yeah, that's right. Run away. Yeah. Now we can place the tracker on said vehicle. Okay, the tracker is online. The signal is getting nice and strong. And the raptor just vanished. <laughs> it's an apparition of my imagination. <laughs> right, how much coin? Like 200? 200? It probably wasn't even worth my time. Whoa, 1,000 actually. They are introducing something where you can watch an advert to double your prize, which is interesting. You might want to do that. Um, so that's that done. And we can't... We can do it? How, how long does it take to get one of these back? Is it not going to tell me? You only get one. Okay. Uh, we've got a lot of quests done. Oh, increase your sanctuary levy and rank up. Yes. Heck yeah, I'll take those. Oh, rank up dinosaurs again. Oh. <gasps> Collect daily quest rewards. Okay, we can definitely get that one. Unlock new dinosaurs. Increase your sanctuary level. <gasps> yes, there's some more daily missions. Yeah, there's a glitch where every time you collect one of these, it goes to achievements, which is a bit odd. Collect all daily request rewards. I don't exactly... Oh, right, it means including the homalocephale. Ah, got you. So, yeah, the, the prize has changed quite a lot in the, like, daily rewards. Like, it used to be a chest... Or it used to be like five keys. It used to be a chest. Now it's like basically a chest. It's like 10 common keys. Uh, so we go to shop. Of course, you've, now because this game is getting closer and closer to becoming live, you've got loads of these um, like microtransactions coming to the game, which I guess isn't so bad. Um, I mean, you don't have to do it, really. You're not facing against weird people. Maybe you will one day. So we got a Giganto Spino crate, which guarantees a Giganto uh, DNA. So let's have a look. Let's open this. And there's also an event uh, specifically tailored to get these as well. So two, you know, 750 coins actually really good. <laughs> Heck yeah, I'll take that. Okay, let's keep going. We're rank 20. Oh yeah, and then this glitch happens if you keep on doing it. So will we, will they fly out? <gasps> they do though. That's good. And another two of that. Right. Um, you can also buy Trodon Crate, Agrocanthosaurus... Patchy. We've got one T-Rex crate, so we may as well open that, as long as it doesn't glitch. No, it didn't. I think if you open up consecutive of the same crate, you do get that glitch, though. It's very good. Oh, we got a freaking T-Rex! Yes! I don't really care about the other ones, but T-Rex? Heck yeah. Just now another 50 more. <laughs> Something ridiculous. Uh, so we've got one rare crate to get, so we may as well get that, because you've got a chance of getting all of those. I think you're guaranteed at least one rare. But maybe it's probably gonna. It's oh, that's right. It's rare as the base, so you're guaranteed more rare and higher. So, uh, you Procephalus, I think is the only one that I kind of need. Yeah, I've got Pro Ceratosaurus, and maybe I have Chunking the Source. I don't even know. Um, and then you got all of this, all of that nonsense. Nobody cares about that. Um, and I think yeah, we've got loads of these to open up. So what we'll do is we'll just quickly rattle through this. Two Dimorphodon, not bad. And then now it'll start glitching, is it? Is it going to glitch? Is it gonna... Yeah, there it is. <laughs> uh, seven common. Not bad, not bad. I, I, there's definitely one dinosaur I'm close to unlocking. It's none of those. Just epics. I think this, there's definitely one epic I'm very close to. Or at least the... Um, is it epic? Yes, I think it is epic. The purple. I'm nowhere near getting another gold, though. Nowhere near. Okay, Carnotaurus. Nice, nice. I mean, I guess so. I guess why not? I'd like some gold ones. Or epics. Epic. I, 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 do I have an epic? I think I have one, and that's Velociraptor, and that's it. Oh, wow, it took ages to load that one. <laughs> it was just like, hmm. What should we give him? Old commons, yes. <laughs> That'll do. Also, I kind of want a better chair. This chair is awful. It's, it's like, just like... Can you hear that? It's like a solid plastic chair. And then it's got like, a, I don't even know, like a millimeter of padding at the bottom. <laughs> it's horrible. I've even just sat here for, what is it, 15 minutes? I can feel my back aching. <laughs> the things I do for you. <laughs> right, let's keep going. Uh, we got three left. Yeah, it's taking longer now. It's like this. Oh, it's really, the server is really struggling. Actually, I think my iPad's struggling. Because when I was opening, opening, opening supply crates on Jurassic World Alive, it would do it, and then at the end, it would, like, take ages. So, 
I don't know. Or maybe iPad. Maybe it's the iPad. Maybe it's the game. Who knows? Oh, a Sino. Nice. Okay, so what am I closest to unlocking? We need six more for Baryonyx. Very good. Sticky Morlock is actually really close. Uh, those ones are even closer as well. Um, but, oh, they've added a Birdosaur. They've added Hararosaurus. I didn't even notice these. And Styracosaurus. Interesting. Okay. I think it was Chasmosaur I thought was added. But these are definitely three. Three new ones. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. I want that T-Rex though. I think I've only got like two T-Rex. Nope. I've got five. And what's a rank six? 50% damage to feared enemies. Apply panic to nearby enemies. Where's Spino? Yeah, there's Spino. It has nothing except for like this, which is rank six. Killing an enemy grants 10% stamina on a kill. Ooh, that's nice. The model's a bit meh. It just kind of looks like a baryonyx scaled up. Um, right, let's do events. So you've got these two events. We've got the rescue for the Giga, which does grant you a whole crate for doing it, but you need to do eight of those. And you can only do two a day. And they cost 15, yeah. So it's like... Really? That's a that's a bit that's a bit too much for me. This is way nicer. 35, boom, done. And let's do some T-Rex. Uh Velociraptor, and we'll do the Carnotaurus, because why not? What we should do, actually, we'll level up Carnotaurus. Seeing as it's really good now. Rank three. Yes! It's not as good, or at least it's actually on the same power level as Homalocephaly. Uh, but it has loads more stamina. Um, and it does more to- Oh, okay, there you go. Rank 11. We've got 20 more keys. Sweet. Um, right, let's do this then. First mission's always a T-Rex, and then after that, it's like... <laughs> oh yeah, I also want to show you the boss battle. I will not forget to show you a boss battle. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Look how overpowered I am! Run into the jungle! You like that song? Yeah, yeah, I can sing. I can sing, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't even care. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you all. <laughs> go, Raptor, go. Right, so that Carnotaurus now lasts for ages if it's rank 30. Yeah, I, I can just run up to things and just hit everybody. Yeah, there you go. Poison? One poison. One damage? Didn't think so. <gasps> um, <laughs> it just sprays poison and gas at you and just go. <laughs> It's an alien! Not even human! Yes! Yeah, the only ones that cause me problem are the shield dudes. At this at this level. Yes. Beautiful. I haven't Ooh, there's the eggs. It's got poison. You could have poisoned the eggs! Alright then. Alright, alright. Go on then you. I mean I'm trying to Okay, that'll do. Do I do damage to the shield? I don't think I do. I don't think I do damage shooting the shields. And boom! There it is! Eggs secured! Why? Because we want omelets. <laughs> Lovely dinosaur omelets. That's one of the reasons why we bring back dinosaurs, isn't it? So we can eat the eggs. Good old eggs. Right, 11 keys, which isn't that much. But because it's one of those that you can't constantly redo, you get a bunch of keys in the mission. It's probably like 20 or 30, will it be? 30. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. So now we've got 86. So we can open up 2, 4, 6, 8. We're going to open up four of them now. Um, and let's see how this one goes. But I do want to show you the boss battle because it's pretty interesting. Um, we've received intel that poachers are after a wild Carnotaurus in the area. Oh no. Whatever will I do? Also, I want to, like, if we could do PvPs or something like that with a, like, a dinosaur team, that would be pretty sweet. Let's keep going. Look, I've got my own one. Ha ha! Surprise! <laughs> oh, oh, that would have been great for the uh, Stegosaur just to whack there. So much explosions. Oh my god, they're gonna... <laughs> they're walking through everything and killing themselves. Come on, Raptor! Off you go! It would be interesting to... For the game to tell you where your dinosaurs are going to emerge from. Because sometimes it's quite tactical. Because they can come from behind the enemies. And other times they just come from behind you. And it's like, oh, okay. Ah! Like, he's he's not using darts. He's using real bullets. And I just eat them all. Like, ah! <laughs> Poison. <gasps> oh, that one does two damage to me. Oh, that's twice as deadly. Oh, dear. All right, are we going to face up against the Carnotaurus? No, it's sleeping. We can't have that. We must wake it up. 
Hold on, now it's an eat that grenade. Ha <laughs> ha! Terrified? You should be. There we go. Shoot him. Beautiful. Yes, Carnotaurus and another Carnotaurus. Oh, best just friends. I still haven't seen Prehistoric Planet. I want to see it. I will see it. Rescue the Carnotaurus. Brilliant. Oh, also. Oh, damn. I've forgotten to set. Oh, did I set that to MP4? Ah, uh, I'm not. I'm, I'm saving an MKV file. Bugger. <laughs> Is there a way? Does it cost 20? It does cost 3. That would take me to another 2. I guess you could do that with this as well. You could just buy, like you can also purchase some now. The total amount of energy offered is added after a purchase, even if it goes over your max. Now, what was really good about this was that I could just, you know, purchase as much battery as I could, because when the game wasn't working for me, I would just log in and just go purchase, purchase, purchase. So I had like hundreds of battery power, whereas they kind of stopped that. I'm hoping that they, they, have fixed that now i'm gonna wait seven seconds to get the 50 and then once that happens i'll purchase because i'll still have one battery left so now if i purchase 20 because 20 dna is nothing i think i got that for logging in and so that takes me 80 ah oh, you buggers you ah that's annoying <laughs> but all right fair enough um oh conotaurus is weak but you're not and you're not. Yes. Oh, let's see how Malo Let's see how Malo. I, th I think it's it's actually pretty decent because it does multiple hits, especially for the shield ones. Oh yes, and then I'll show the boss fight. Yes, it's very quick. Don't worry, it won't take too long. I know you've got places to be. <laughs> oh boy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What about a Homalo Wherever he is, there he is. Go on, run in. Go. <laughs> Oh, as you can see, this one's a lot tougher. This battle. I've already lost a quarter of my health. All right, come on, Osefle. Off you go. Oh, okay. You can hit a rock. That's fine. Yeah. Stegosaur just proving why it's really the MVP. And just go for the overkill there. That's fine. That, that's completely fine. You can do whatever it wants. As long as I win. I don't care. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, they don't die in one hit now. That's that's. Crazy! I need that level 20 stego. And we are pretty close to it. Go on, Omala Zephyr! Oh, the double whammy. Oh god, not good, not good. Yep, I'm just gonna let the dinosaurs just uh, soak up a few bullets there. Da -da -da. I, th I think what's strong about this game, what I really enjoy, is the boss battles. Like, this is kind of okay. It's like meh. Oh, the sniper bullets don't kill you in one anymore, but they do a lot of damage, which I'm very grateful for. Because that was horrendous when they would just kill you. Like, cheers. Feels bad. <laughs> okay, I need a meat shield. Go, Stego. Oh, I'm on a subway. Oh, oh, no. oh got to be careful of fire. Sometimes it does one damage. And other times it does 20. So, yeah, big difference there. Oh, yes. That's good. Yep, yeah, very good, very good. Look at that. He probably killed the shield, dude. What a legend. I hate those guys. Every map has one of them. Oh, there's a shot in there. Like, oh, the cutscene's not played yet, mate. Away, oh, man. Who are you playing at me? <laughs> Whoosh. Yeah, he killed him in one shot. That was brilliant. Go, Hamalo, Sefley. Go again. I want a full team of Hamalos. That'd be brilliant. Oh, we got to be careful here. All right, Stego. Just just go in and... Whoosh. Lots of damage. I don't know why I keep tapping. I'm just click and hold. That's it. I think we're done think we're done. We're starting to get a decent amount of coin now from killing stuff. Which is good. <laughs> and that is the laptop broken. Somehow, it was in the rain before. I think we just needed to go click a few buttons on it. <laughs> Hack the terminal for Intel. Is that right? Is that what I did? It doesn't look like that's what I did, but okay. Right. Okay. Squad as well. The, the squad thing's a bit like... <laughs> I think if you do one... How am I do one? <laughs> if you do one of them, then it goes towards... Oh, you complete one. Yeah, it goes towards this mission. So you may as well do that. It's quite quick. Quick and easy. To do the dailies is very simple. I quite like that. Um, oh, yes! We can do a rank four... Oh, oh he's T-posing. He's T-posing. He needs a hand. There you go. Rank four. Is that shocked? Does it do anything? I want to have a look at this. Oh, we've, up we've ranked up again, which is good. Uh, what do we even get for ranking up? Like, it says rank 11. 
But do we not get anything unless we unlock all the stuff? For the Velociraptor, I need Herarasaurus and I need blue. And that's not going to happen anytime soon. Uh, does it make a difference? Not really. But it was quite cool the way it looked, though. We've received reports of a wild Ichthylvenator in the area. Be careful. She's scared. Rubbish. All right, okay, so it's a swamp. What? Like, that's a completely new biome we've never seen, which is sweet. There's, like, garbage bags. It's in the bayou. It's in misery. Oh, and there's some dead bones. Well, they can't be alive bones, James, can they? <laughs> right, so... Yeah, you've got the Ichthovenator there. We'll just sit on a bench. This is a this is a great Easter egg, because if you stay if you stay by the bench, that happens. Look how cool that was. That was amazing. Anyway, uh, so yeah, we'll just Oh, I think it does a lot of damage. It doesn't like bleed damage, as you can see. It didn't even hit me there, and it's doing bleed damage. But when it's on low health, look look what it does. Look what it does. Look at that! It regains health by eating fish. That's so cool. Although saying that. It's gonna die pretty quick. Uh, there you go. <laughs> but it's a cool little concept. And now I need to hit everything but the helicopter. There we go. We got a whole bunch of stuff. So for like two seconds of that battle, you get loads of um, loads of gear. I think you get a decent amount of coin as well, and I think you can double it. So th 538. You can just watch an advert and get 1,600 as well as rare DNA. It's just so good. It's so freaking good. If you've got the Barry, you might as well just do that. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to... Ooh, did I do something? <gasps> what did I do? What did I do? I got a quest. Sweet! Story missions. Brilliant. So what I'll do is I will keep, like, just, you know, grinding through. We'll get to the elite missions, see how far we can get there. And, of course, if there's any dinosaurs that I unlock along the way... Oh gosh, okay, so dear. But if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye bye.